welcome to the mathematics of my channel today we are going to solve another interesting limit question limit n approaches to infinity 1 plus 1 over n square 1 plus 2 square n square times 1 plus 3 square n square dot 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 1 plus n square n square and raised to the 1 over n power okay how to begin first we can take this is equal to L and now if we take natural log both side here natural log of L is equal to here limit n approaches to infinity and now according to uh, property of natural log we can write 1 over n in this place here 1 over n and now here again according to property of natural log we can write this product as a sum so we can write natural log 1 plus 1 over n square plus natural log of 1 plus 2 square over n square plus this is i skip this step and here final term natural log 1 plus n square over n square okay now we can write natural log of L is equal to limit n goes to infinity and here 1 over n and we can write this is equal to sum of 0 to uh, n sum of 0 to n natural log of common term 1 plus r square over n square ok now what can we do I think this is familiar with us we know to convert this sum as an integral uh, we discussed about in details in a previous video so I will add the link in the description and also make a card so we can write here this is equal to integral form 0 to 1 natural log of 1 plus now instead of our n we know x so x square dx now we have an integral so how to evaluate this integral we can use by parts method so we can write 0 to 1 I rewrite first function as a natural log of 1 plus x square here d by dx and v next term uh, we can take x dx and now uh, product of these two functions so we can write x times natural log of 1 plus x square limit 0 to 1 minus integral from 0 to 1 now rewrite this function so x now derivative of first function so natural log of 1 plus x square 1 over 1 plus x square and according to chain rule derivative of x square so we know 2 times x dx ok then we can write uh, natural log of L is equal to now here if we plug in 1 uh, 1 times natural log of 1 plus 1 so natural log of 2 so natural log of 2 now if we plug in 0 here 0 now minus integral from 0 to 1 so 0 to 1 and here now 2 is a common factor so we can write outside of the integral sign and here we have x square over 1 plus x square so we can uh, yeah we can create the denominator in the numerator so we can write 1 plus x square minus 1 over 1 plus x square dx ok now here natural log of 2 minus 
2 integral from 0 to 1 now if we divided this term by 1 plus x square so 1 minus 1 over 1 plus x square dx okay then yeah natural log of 2 minus 2 now integral of 1 dx so x here yeah, antiderivative we know inverse or arctan of x from 0 to 1 now natural log of 2 minus 2 now if we plug in 1 here 1 minus 10 uh, inverse 10 1 so we have 5 over 4 if we plug in 0 here 0 <coughs> well now uh, this natural log of 2 we can write in left hand side so now natural log of l minus natural log of 2 is equal to minus times minus plus 5 over 2 here minus 2 okay then here according to property of natural log we can write this is equal to natural log of l over 2 is equal to here we can write pi over 4 over 2 now we can take uh, l over 2 is equal to e to the pi over sorry pi minus 4 over 2 now l is equal to 2 times e to the pi minus 4 over 2 okay this is the answer if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching